Chicken legs. Hello. Chicken legs. Alright. Yeah. But anyway, season these up. Sorry about that. Uh, I had to click off for a second. One of my neighbors came over and was telling me how he enjoyed the smoked tilapia on uh, one of my other cooking videos. You can check that out on my playlist. But yeah, just season these up real good. And uh, of course, it's freezing out here, so those will be good just to hang out right there for a while until I get the charcoals going. All right, hang tight. Yeah. So see, also, and uh, I've showed it and explained it before in some of my other videos. Uh, this grill didn't come with a, a sliding lid blocker shield thing. For the offset smoker so i just found me a rock and put it up against there because if you're trying to do something indirect heat like what we're doing today that that's a that's a lot of space inside there with cold air because it's freezing out here uh you know and you want that blocked off because you're not trying to heat that too you're trying to heat just this so anyway that's why i've got that rock sitting over there but also all right yeah, another train <laughs> going by, but no, I built this little uh, little shelter thing the other day for my uh, charcoal situation. That way I don't have to try to do it on a porch where my smoker is. And uh, it's working pretty good. But uh, yeah, also here's my, my burn barrel with my other little grill. It sits perfectly in the top of that thing. You can see that in action in some other videos too. But anyway, yep, we're getting these charcoals ready to go. And we're gonna do those chicken legs. Been marinating in uh, that Texas uh, barbecue seasoning. But I got another little twist ahead. So hold tight, hang tight. Chicken, charcoals, hang tight. All right, with our trusty charcoal tongs, we're gonna spread these out. Get them over here, concentrated. Right. I don't know it. Yeah. Then, what we're gonna do gonna throw some mesquite wood chips on there. Got some right here, been soaking in the rain water and the snow. Alright. And uh, I'm gonna close the lid down for a minute and let these get started. Hang tight. Actually, what I'm gonna do is because uh, these have been hanging out for so, uh, such a long minute. I'm just gonna move them directly over the heat. We're gonna sear them, flip them over, sear them, and then we're gonna move them back over to this side and let them smoke and slow cook. Right. All right, so as you can see, I moved all the thickest parts to the center center of the fire we're gonna cook these right over that sear them on both sides and we'll then we'll slide them over here and let them smoke and slow cook all right there we go all right so check it out they've been on there for a good eight minutes I just coated them with some butter and uh, we're letting them go I hadn't flipped them over yet but we're on direct heat and uh, we got it going on oh yeah smells wonderful Woo. all right that's what I'm talking about yeah buddy we got it going on flip that around 
flip those around. Oh yeah. We got it going on. Butter, seasonings. Woo! Man. I'm telling you what. Good stuff. Ah. Yeah, buddy. Woo! That's hot. Steamy. Alright. Now, if those are all flipped around, we we'll to close this lid back down. Alright. Let's get them seared. Then we'll slow do it. Oh, yeah. That is smoking. That's right. Oh. Neighbors are smelling that. <laughs> Holy moly. That's right. Where are we at up here? We're about uh, about 250. That's where we want to be. All right. Oh yeah. We're about a good 18, 20 minutes into it since I put it over directly over the heat. We're gonna let those go for a little bit longer and uh, turn them around, flip them over, let the other side get a little bit more done. And then, to top it all off, it's going to be good. Never tried it. Can't wait to, though. It's going to be good. Hang on. All right. We're about 30 minutes into it. Flip them over a little bit. Looking all right. Looking all right. Smelling wonderful. Oh Lord, money! I'm gonna get these all turned around and uh, get back with you. Hang tight. All right, let's check this out, man. We're up to about 300. Uh, all right. Woo. Hello. So what we're gonna do now is I haven't even added new charcoal. We're just gonna move this over like we first planned. That's still doing pretty good. Still got some wood chips on there. Those legs are looking pretty good. Looking real good. Smelling real good. We're just going to let this go just like this. We're not going to add any more new charcoal. Put this lid back down and let it, let it go for a minute. That's right. Yeah, focus it. 200. All right. Perfect. All right, folks, we're still up at about 300. These are pretty much done. And for the last twist, well, first, let's take a look at them. Oh, yeah. Those are looking pretty good. That's right. So, what we're going to do on the last part is we're going to coat them in some of this. Olive Garden Signature Italian Dressing. Uh, it is good stuff. I'm not uh, promoting them. I'm just saying. What we're going to do is we're going to just coat these things like this right here. Woo. Yeah, buddy. Put that lid back down. Let those continue to hang out. Yeah, that's a tarp uh, blowing in the wind in the background because the, it's windy. <laughs> anyway, yep, we're almost there. Hang tight. All right. Yeah, that should go back up pretty good here shortly. All right. Oh, yeah. Those are looking fine, fine. Oh, Lord Almighty. I don't know, right? Woo! Man. 